ever pondered over the origins of Islamic ancient texts? These texts, rich with wisdom, history, and knowledge, have shaped the course of human civilization in numerous ways. Let's dive deep into the ocean of Islamic ancient texts, tracing their roots back to the early days of Islam. In the 7th century, the birth of Islam in the Arabian Peninsula marked the beginning of Islamic literature. The first and most fundamental text, the Quran, came into existence. Muslims believe the Quran is the word of Allah as revealed to Prophet Muhammad over a span of 23 years. It's a text that has remained unchanged for over 14 centuries, illustrating the principles of faith, morality, and guidance for personal conduct. Following the Quran, the Hadith literature holds a paramount position in Islamic texts. These are the sayings, actions, and approvals of the Prophet Muhammad. The compilation of Hadiths began in the 8th century, with scholars like Imam Bukhari and Imam Muslim painstakingly collecting, verifying, and recording these narrations. Then, we come across the Tafsir literature, which interprets and explains the Quran. Noteworthy scholars like Ibn Kathir and Al-Tabari contributed significantly to this genre. Their works, dating back to the 9th and 10th centuries, provide comprehensive explanations of Quranic verses, offering insights into their historical and contextual background. The following centuries saw the emergence of fiqh literature, which deals with Islamic jurisprudence. It includes the discussions of scholars and jurists on various issues, deriving laws from the Quran and Hadith. Key texts like the Muqtasar of Al-Quduri and Al-Hidayah guide Muslims in matters of worship, transactions, and personal affairs. In the realm of Islamic philosophy, the 12th century scholar Ibn Rushd, often known in the West as Averroes, made a significant contribution. His work attempted to reconcile faith with reason, and his texts continue to influence both Muslim and Western philosophy. To summarize, the journey through Islamic ancient texts is a passage through time, witnessing the evolution of thought, culture, and laws. It starts with the divine revelation of the Quran in the 7th century, followed by the compilation of the Hadiths. The subsequent centuries saw the development of tafsir and fiqh literature, providing explanations and interpretations of Quranic verses and Islamic laws. Finally, the exploration ends with the philosophical texts of Ibn Rushd, blending faith and reason. These texts, each unique and profound, have left an indelible mark on human civilization. They continue to guide, inspire, and stimulate intellectual curiosity, opening doors to a world of wisdom and knowledge that transcends time. So, the next time you delve into these texts, remember, you're not just reading, you are journeying through centuries of human thought and wisdom.